to my channel, Couponing with Kayla. So we are at Publix today. We're about to head in here and check out some deals. Your deals may start on Wednesday or they may start on Thursday. In my area, since they start on Wednesday, I'm going to go ahead in here and grab some items. As always, I'll have a printable list below the video. See, welcome to Publix <laughs> and welcome to my channel. Don't forget to hit that red subscribe button below and hit that thumbs up if you enjoy the video. So first up, we're going to grab some Vanity Fair napkins. These are buy one, get one free at $3.29. So I'm going to go ahead and pick up two of these. Now on the napkins, we have a couple of coupons we're going to use. So on these, you can go ahead and you can use a $1.50 printable coupon. You can get on the Vanity Fair site, so it's $1.50 off two. Then in public, they're selling these little coupon sheet, sheets for the um, Children's Miracle Network. So you can use two of these $1 coupons right here. So that is going to make these free and a 21 cent money maker. So that's a really good deal right there on the napkins, especially if you have any gatherings coming up. You got 100 count napkins right here. So 200 napkins for free. Next, we're going to grab the Purex laundry soap. So if you have this $1 coupon from the 619 save, go ahead and use that. If you live in Half Bogo, you could get one of these for $349. Use the dollar coupon, get a dollar back on Ibotta, and make it $149 for one. But if you do need to buy two, go ahead and grab two. The coupon's a limit of one, but then you're going to get $2 back on Ibotta, $1 for each one. So it would make it $3.99 for two big bottles. Next up, we're picking up these STEM products. So no sell on these. They're $7.49 each. So two is going to total us $14.98. But we have a buy one, get one free coupon we just got in our $6.26 Smart Source. So with this coupon, it'll take off the $7.49. That'll leave you to pay $7.49. But we have a $6.99 digital on the Publix app. And for that, it normally will glitch with the paper coupon. So if it does, it's going to make it $0.50 cents for both. Now, what you want to do is give them your paper coupon first then after you're all done handing over paper coupons type in your phone number at the end of the transaction and if the digital is going to glitch it will come off at the end now i'm also going to pick up the raid that's also 7.49 so two of these we are going to use this buy one get one free coupon from the 626 smart source Using that, it'll take off a max of $7, bringing us down to $7.98. But we have a three off two digital that will probably glitch with this. Plus we have $2 back on each on Ibotta. So we could get these for as low as 98 cents for both. Now, if your cashier takes off the full $7.49, it'd be 49 cents for both. Next up, if you like the Truly Butter, so this is grass-fed butter, uh, they have salted and non-salted, all of that. If you want to pick these up, they're 3 for $10 this week, but there's a dollar back on each on Ibotta. So you'd get $3 back if you pick up three, making them 3 for $7, or around $2.30 each. Next up, if you need some Bic razors, you can grab this one for $6.47. We have a $2 store coupon in the extra savings booklet, and we also have a $3 digital coupon. So it would make it just $1.47 for one of these. Oh my gosh, you guys, look, I have been wanting to find these for so long. I have a $4 off Peely coupon or tear pad coupon. Anyways, this is a store coupon, so this is going to be perfect for a Colgate deal. All right, guys, so we've got Colgate toothpaste. Buy one, get one free at $4.10. We're going to use our $4 store coupon. So we're going to go ahead and grab four of these for a total of $8.20. We are going to use our four off two. Then we have a digital coupon for three off two. Now, also, if you look at the boxes of toothpaste, some of them have little Peely coupons for 50 cents, if you see this right here. So we can use two of those 50 cent Peely coupons for our other two. Now, after all of our coupons, our final cost is gonna be 20 cents for all four, which I think is an awesome, awesome deal. I mean, we get toothpaste for free all the time, but 20 cents for four boxes is not bad. So I just wanted to show you guys really quickly. You might remember I bought some hot dogs a while back um, and they go for quite a while, but anyways, so I already have mine stocked up, but if you need some for 4th of July, there's tons of different brands buying it one free. 
Next up, we're gonna grab Pop-Tarts. They're on sale this week for five for $10. Now on the Kellogg's Family Rewards website, you can go ahead and print you a couple of coupons. So we have $1 off two coupons. We also have 50 cent off one coupons. So I'm trying to decide which kind I'm gonna get. I, I know, well, I haven't seen the cherry ones in a while, so that's why I'm getting those. The apple ones I've never tried before. Um, or did it? Yeah, it said apple. Okay. <laughs> Anyways, then I'm going to get a few of the ones that I know that we like. So we're going to go ahead, pick these up. We're going to use our two $1 off two coupons from the Kellogg's Family Rewards website. We're also going to use a 50 cent off one. So I'm going to lay these out here so you guys can see. So you should be able to print all these. I printed this from one account. It normally lets you get two prints per coupon. So I went ahead, got these. After the coupons, it's going to put us at $7.50 for five of these or about $1.50 a box. So if you like the Kellogg snacks, these are buy one get one free this week at Publix as well for $5.49. On Ibotta, they're giving back $2 per box. So if you grab two of these, you're going to get $4 back on Ibotta, making it $1.49 for both. So definitely an easy, easy deal if you want to pick these up. Next, I'm going to grab one of the Happy Gift Cards for $50 because we have a coupon in the Extra Savings Booklet where if you spend $50 on groceries before coupons and you also purchase a $50 Happy Gift Card, you'll get $10 off of your purchase. So there's several different places on here. I could use that Bed Bath & Beyond, I'm sure. So <laughs> I'm going to go ahead and grab it. This is the coupon that you want to clip out of the Extra Savings Booklet. All right, guys, so this is what I am picking up. Don't forget this coupon expires on July 1st if you want to do this deal. Otherwise, you can still grab all these other deals throughout the week. So we're going to go ahead and head over to self-checkout. All right, guys, so this is my total with tax before the gift card and before any coupons. I'm going to go ahead and scan the gift card. You want to cover this little barcode at the top and then just scan the main barcode on that. Please wait for us. All right, so the cashier came over and approved that. Now, I already did my Vanity Fair napkin coupons as well, those two $1 ones, but we're gonna go ahead and do all of our other ones. No coupon beeps so far, no issues with the $10 gift card coupon. He came over and put that in with no problem. So we're gonna go ahead, do these. I shake it around because sometimes it doesn't realize your coupon's in there, especially with smaller ones, and then you have to like stick a piece of paper in there or something to like make it know that it had your coupon went in there so anyways um if you're using a Publix coupon like there we go so yeah that's why i had to do that because it didn't even recognize that small coupon but anyways if you're using a Publix coupon you type in the little code at the bottom so we'll do that here in a second we're going to go ahead and finish up these and i'm saving my buy one get one free coupons for last so the little lookup code in the bottom right corner of the store coupon, you just type that in just like you would a fruit or vegetable and it'll take off that coupon for you. Now with the buy one get one free, if you're at self checkout, the cashier will come over and enter the amount of the item. So that's why I save one for last. All right guys, so I am about to hit pay. I'm typing in my phone number right now. So you can see my total and this is including the gift card and including tax. Now, once I hit pay, the digitals will come off so look there we did get glitches on those digital coupons plus our Colgate digital came off that's our total with tax and with a $50 gift card all right guys so we are back in the car from Publix the transaction went great the cashier was really nice had no coupon beeps any issues like that so for this happy $50 gift card plus everything else I picked up I paid let's see here $55.97 plus tax okay so $50 of that was that gift card so we're gonna go ahead we're gonna submit to the rebate apps see how much our final cost is for all of these items so let's go ahead head home sit at the table look over the receipt and talk final cost of everything all right guys so i am back home and this is my Publix haul for this week so we're gonna go ahead we're gonna go over the receipt talk final cost of all of our items so if you look right here on my receipt sorry let me get it okay so if you look right here you can see all of our items then right down here, we can see our coupon. So we had the $10 off of the Happy Gift Card when you purchase ten, or when you purchase $50 worth of groceries plus a $50 gift card. We had our two store coupons for the Vanity Fair napkins. 
And then we had two $1 coupons I used for the Pop-Tarts. That was a dollar off two. And then I used a 50 cent coupon for 50 cents off one Pop-Tart. So total of five Pop-Tarts there. Then we used another $1 coupon. That $1 coupon was for the Purex. And then I had a $1.50 coupon for the Vanity Fair napkins. I used my store coupon for Colgate for $4 off of four products. I did forget to use the two 50 cent Peely coupons for Colgate. So that would have given me an extra dollar in savings, but that's okay. Um, then the last couple of coupons that I used paper coupon wise was the buy one get one free for Raid and the buy one get one free for STEM. So you can see that the cashier entered in $7.49 off of each of those so did give the full price. I believe one of the coupons said up to an $8 value and one said up to a $7 value. Um, but he went ahead and did $7.49 on each. Then you can see that the digital coupon for $6.99 off STEM did glitch and come off with the paper coupon for STEM. And then the RAID 3 off 2 coupon did glitch with the buy one get one free paper coupon for the RAID. So I kind of thought that that would happen a lot of times at Publix if we have a buy one get one free paper and digital. If you're using the paper version, normally after you type in your phone number at checkout, then the digital will also come off. So what I normally do is I go ahead, scan all my items, then I scan all my paper coupons. After that, I will go ahead, I'll enter my phone number, and then when you hit pay, that's when the digitals will come off. So you wanna do paper coupons first, and then if the digitals are going to glitch, they will afterwards. So you can see right down here, I also have my three off two Colgate digital coupon come off. That got my subtotal down to $55.97. So that included a $50 gift card. So that means we were down to $5.97. You can see our savings. The summary shows store coupons, $16 in savings. Vendor coupons, which is manufacturer coupons, $32.97 in savings. And then special price savings, like buy one, get one free, and sale prices, we saved $19.83. So a total of $68.80 in savings there. So I went ahead, I submitted my receipt over to Ibotta. On Ibotta, I got $2 back for each of the Raid products and $1 back for the Purex. So a total of $5 back on Ibotta. Making my final cost today for everything that you see right here, including the gift card, $50.97. Now, if you take away the gift card, then that means that all these other items just cost $0.97, cents, which I think is amazing. If I had used the two 50 cent paper coupons for the Colgate, then it would have been completely free and basically I would have just paid for the gift card. So let me know in the comments below if you're excited about any of this week's deals. Let me know if you tried those apple fritter pop tarts. So I wonder if those are good. I figured, hey, why not? We're getting a deal on them. Might as well get them. And yeah, let me know if you do the raid or the stem deal, if that works for you. I appreciate you guys so, so much for watching. Don't forget to grab that free printable list below the video, as well as all your money saving apps. And I'll see you later. Bye guys.